Hey, everybody, two boys, one brain cell. I'm Joel Norton, and this is Charles Beeson. You got to quit showing me your shirt on that screen. I'm a ghost today, guys. I'm a ghost. Super spooky. I wanted to rep my Riot Fest sucks Chicago shirt. And he wanted to rep it so it, it was, much. It's sad. It's blue. It's blue. It's a turquoise. It's a turquoise, but it's still getting picked up by the thing, unfortunately. Yeah. This is blue. But at least it has something to center me. You know what I mean? Yeah. You can see where my body is. So and I make... love how your arms are just floating. It doesn't, yeah. <laughs> um, Today we're checking out Mosh for Jesus. Midwestern songs of the Americas by Dillinger 4. Yeah. Have you ever moshed for Jesus? No. I don't think I have. I have not either. You ever been to a Christian concert? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Same. Yeah, so. There's never been a mosh pit. Yeah, maybe if I would, like, skillet, maybe. Yeah. But they're not extremely heavy, but maybe you get a little close. <laughs> That'd be sweet, though, wouldn't it? It would be fun. <laughs> I have mosh in a POD pit. Does it count? They're, 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 I think they're a Christian band. I, I don't know. Pretty sure. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Okay. It doesn't really matter, because we're listening to Dillinger 4. Send it. Shout out to our Patreon. Let's go. A baggage person and a silent motive to take this shit home by the fucking throne and then it's on our hands. And that's how a new world began. A person plays the quiet indignation. A mother down to start the conflagration till we cross our voice. We'll make a terrible noise. Tried to get the lyrics up, and yeah. then pop-ups kept popping up. My favorite part, we Super both looked nice. down at our phones right away yep. to look up lyrics. Yeah. Yeah, it was just... And then I, when enough. I realized that you were, I'm like, <laughs> I'm going to put my phone down. It's, it's <laughs> just rough enough, you know, that it, it was it was kind of hard to... It, it, at the beginning. By the end, I was yeah. like, okay, I can catch. Yeah. A vague expression and a silent motive to take the shithole by the fucking throat. And that's where we heard Wrath get ripped. Yeah. And Jack's like, I heard F-bombs. I need to see what's going on. Yes. And then it's on our hands, and that's how the new world began. Passing phase of quiet indignation and Molotov to start the conflagration. Till we've lost our voice, we'll make a joyful noise. And when a penny for your treason is worth a thousand more of hollow freedom, uh, the world is feeling twice as cold today, and there's no more disgusting. No more disguising. disguising. Thank you. Just, just decay. Okay. A new discussion. All this shit, I gotta believe it was an accident. 
Yeah, a new discussion of an age-old question, an age-old method towards a new direction. When the going's tough, will bite the hand that feeds, break the fist that abuses, be the voice of truth in a world so truthless and juvenile, a stab in the back with a smile. Yeah. There's some good-ass lines in here. Yeah. I really like the nah, 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 nah. Yeah. <laughs> the, that was random, I felt like, compared yeah, to the rest of the song. Oh, yeah. It's like suddenly we're going to get a little lighthearted on you. Yeah. yeah. No, not bad at all. No, not bad at all. Um, I agree. I, at first, I was like, <clears throat> there for a second, I thought it was like going to be kind of a jab at religion. Yeah. If, and then it kind of wasn't. If it was, I mean, it was like kind of a little bit at organized religion. Yeah. At the end, ignorance, intolerance, abounding. Yeah. You know what I mean? Or maybe like just random. It's very light. Yeah. It's lighthearted in yes. a way. Yes. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It's not just a blatant attack. You'd think it would be. Can, with all the the beginning, how it kicked yeah. off. I was like, oh, what do we got going on here, guys? Uh-huh. And then it was, I heard that, and I did not see that coming at all. It seems very well written, actually. Yeah. How could this be part of a Yeah. Ignorance, intolerance abounding. How could this be part of any greater plan? Yeah. 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 I mean, obviously, so it's like it's, questioning the yeah. the right type of things. It's more questioning than yeah, attacking, and I like that. Yeah, it's pointing out you get behind that one hundred percent. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Ratings. ratings, fucking ratings, bud. Bro, we can't do that. We're not allowed to say it at the same time. I don't approve. I'm gonna go with a five point eight. Okay. I think this will grow on me, but that's just off first listen. And like yeah. I said, the first half of the song was like, "Ooh, this is a little rough." I don't know if it's rough, but it was it was hardcore. Yeah, and so I I don't know why I wasn't expecting it because we we've only heard one Dillinger Fork song. Yeah, and that definitely grew on me. Um, but I didn't get very it wasn't very hardcorey where yeah. this it was. Yeah. So the first half of the song I was like, what the fuck's going on? I heard mm-hmm. f bomb. I'm hearing little words dropped in. Yep. You know what I mean? But that's about it. Um, but now kind of looking at those lyrics, you see there's a lot there. The second half of the song, I was already kind of adapting to the genre yeah. and picking up what they were saying. So I think there's room to grow here, but on initial listen, that's what I'm going to go with. Yeah. I'm going to go with a, playlist. yeah, I'm going to go with a six one. Yep. And that's just cause you could still see the handprint on the side of my face. Cause as soon as it started, I just whap slap, slap me right across the cheek. Oh, I love it. <laughs> and definitely going to go on a playlist. And now the moment you've all been waiting for. Chuck or dreading F bombs. Yes, if you're do. dreading it, then stop the video here. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I'm, just joking. I'm, just joking. I'm kid, I kid. Stop it now. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Damn, Joel. <laughs> oh, sorry. Um Me so sorry. So this one, it's very simple. Very well, yeah. It, it, it is. It is. To take this shit hole by the fucking throat. It was very, very simple. What's wrong, Chuck? Mosh for Jesus. I'm going to smack you in the face with a bomb right off the rip. Yes. And it's going to be the only one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I mean, yeah. Yeah. It, that that's a great placement it caught me way off guard. It did I saw that that, that added some humor to it? For yeah, me, for me. So I'm definitely gonna go. I'm gonna go with an eight point six on this one. Oh, all right. for sure. Because I mean, just that whack, just right off the rip. You know, I like that. I mean, it's a not quite. Yeah, right off the rip, but it's close enough. Yeah, and did not see it coming in a song like this. This is like that when you're a kid and you have, you want some edgy music and you're only allowed to listen to you know Christian music. And you're like, Mom, look, they're Christian. This is Moss for Jesus. Better pray to God you didn't help. He listened, actually catch the, <laughs> you listening to it. Though. Right? I love it. The slip it slip it onto the radar, you know what I'm saying? I didn't have much of that problem. I know you didn't. I didn't. I was in the backseat of my parents' car listening to. Uh, you had country. Darling Nikki by Prince. So. <laughs> Uh, well, dude, that was one of my favorite songs. It took me forever in my adult life to find that song. Yeah, one of those. I love those because I'm like, where you, this song is in my head. Where you get like one little bit, and then you're like, it's very nostalgic. And it's always that Nikki, 
wow. line. Obviously, I can't sing it like him. I'm not, I'm not going to try. Um, but that just stuck in my head for, like, my whole life. Yeah. Interesting. You can vote for the brain cell down in the comments down below. Absolutely. Especially since Chuck went from talking about hardcore to a prince. <laughs> I was reference, referencing a relatable thing that I had to listen to Christian music, and you could slip under the radar, and you started talking about Prince. <laughs> Chuck's like, let's go fucking tangent! <laughs> Welcome to my life of chaos. <laughs> hey, trust me, when this is in my playlist, Darling Nikki's coming on right after it. Just wait. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, you can smash that like button or dislike. I understand. <laughs> I don't. Help me. What did I no. do? <laughs> if you would like to replace me, please get a hold of this guy. Yes, that's not, that won't happen. You will be declined. I need, yeah. I, well, you know what's fucked up is I'm not getting brain cells. So I'm like, this is not working out. The system that I set up, <laughs> I was like, I'm going to rake in all these brain cells and I'm going to be smart as fuck. And it has backfired hard. Yes. Chuck's got all the brain cells. Not a whole lot smarter, as you can see. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, we're two boys, one brain cell. A uh, Peace out. Have a good night. <laughs> Go do a mosh for Jesus. <laughs>